uh, welcome. Today I'm going to talk about menu planning. Uh, we This is kind of one of those things that so many people think is so challenging and really once you get started and you come up with a good system that works for you, it actually can be really, really simple. So I don't claim to be an expert, I'm just sharing some of the things that work for me um, and I hope that it will also work for you. So I'm literally going to just take you with me and we are gonna, I'm going to make my, my menu plan and then I'm going to film a separate video when I do groceries and kind of share some of the tips and trades that um, have worked for me in that angle. So um, a couple things, I really only stick to three basically staple meats or fish in our house on a weekly basis and I do the same schedule for two weeks. So I do that so that it is an easy um, ingredient. I do it because uh, it, it helps me have a breather. So that way I'm not coming up with whole new recipes for um, two weeks, but instead I'm coming up with um, just simple ideas for each, um, each day. So I make a menu list from uh, Friday to the following two weeks, Thursday. So in this specific situation, I'm going to be making a menu plan from 3.11 to 3.24. Um, this obviously worked for any other time. So I actually just write out each day. Like I said, I'm going to take you with me this whole thing so that you can see that it doesn't take forever. And it actually can be something to be enjoyed. Okay, so I write down all of my dates in a piece of paper, and then I actually write out, um, <laughs> this is kind of silly, but I put uh, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, and Monday. Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. Um, and then my next step is I go through and I look at what our schedule looks like for those days. So if we're if we're not going to be um, here or we're going to families or whatever we're doing, I make an asterisk. So um, I go through and I figure out where we're out. So we're going to be out there. We're out here. This is us. It's always such a treat to be out. Um, on Wednesdays, I usually have more people, so I make a little asterisk to remember because um, I need to make extra food. And okay, so I'm making my breakfast. Okay, so. I made my asterisk, I put when we're going to be out, very, very simple, nothing too crazy, and away we go. So um, we always, Friday nights are kind of our free night, we do pizza, um, we keep it simple, we go Trader Joe's style, and we, um, we just get dough and we make pizza kind of a healthy version. Um, so I know I'm going to have pizzas on Friday. Then, um, so we are pretty simple right now because we eat off the 21 day fix meeting, uh, meal plan. So we try not to have carbs after three. That's just kind of our staple in our house. And we stick to veggies and protein at nighttime. So I do the tailor-made, um, actually I really like the Vaughn's version of the tailor-made pre-cut salads. They offer um, tons of different vegetables. Their dressings are not that fatty. Um, they're just like really great, really great um, easy salads, so we use those a lot, like basically all the time. I eat those for lunch, I eat those for dinner, we basically can have stock and we can just eat the salads. So um, I always like to do a crock pot chili and, um, or some sort of crock pot meal in the week. So for, I'm going to do a, let's see, we like taco salad, so let's do taco salad on Wednesday because that's a day that we have more people so I'm going to put it on each week on the Wednesday so that it's done and we'll go over the ingredients in the grocery list after um, then I'm going to do a uh, let's see here 
So the trusty thing that I do is I head over to Pinterest and I'm going to put in 21 day fix recipes because it doesn't get easier than this. And then I'm just going to peruse and see what I can come up with and find for some healthy meal options. Um, we'll do salmon on uh, the day. So I'm going to do salmon and Asian salad. So I'm going to do salmon. Um, on Sundays, I like to have a crock pot meal because we go to the zoo, so I like to have it already made. So I'm going to go ahead and put chili, and I'll figure out what kind of chili and from where, um, or you know what kind of toppings, that kind of thing, as soon as um, I'm done making the list. And then let's do... some chicken. So this sounds good. Buffalo chicken veggie bake casserole. Sounds pretty delicious. So I'm going to look that up and go ahead and make sure the way I kind of decide when I'm looking up new recipes that I've never tried is I really look at how many ingredients there are. Nobody wants to spend, see like that for example, had a lot of recipe, had a lot of ingredients. So no one wants to make that. So ooh, garlic chicken in the crock pot. I mean, crock pot chicken aren't always the best, but let's go ahead and see what they've got here. Ooh, it doesn't have very many recipes or very many ingredients. Excuse me. Ew! Ew! Oh, excuse me. Okay. So I think we're going to do this 21 day fix garlic chicken. It has chicken, some chicken stock, some cloves of garlic, and some dash seasoning. Sounds fantastic. So uh, let's do that on Thursdays. We'll do a garlic chicken crock pot. And what I do is I just pin that recipe in my clean eating pin board, and then I know that those recipes are all in there for me to find. Uh, okay, I think I just need one more recipe. Pesto caprese chicken. Ooh, this looks delicious. I can always have a little more chicken in my life, right? do pesto chicken. Okay, and then I have one poll left and it's a night where the girls are going out and all the boys are hanging out here, so I'm gonna do a frozen orange chicken <laughs> for my hubby because every once in a while he deserves a little treat. So this is what he's gonna get. So that, clean eating. So there is my two week menu. It took us nine minutes and that was half of it explained, me explaining it to you. You are so welcome to use my board for recipes. I basically tried all of them. Um, but that's kind of the staples. We don't get crazy, we keep it simple. We keep it easy. We don't, um, I don't want to spend, I try to keep this low. This is like, I feel like if the one thing I can do for our household is to keep our grocery list lower, especially with two kids in diapers. So this is kind of the way that I've been able to do that. Um, so that's about it. That is how we, lucky for me, we have seem to have quite a few outs um, this coming next two weeks. So there won't be too much cooking, but that's pretty much um how I make a menu. So I hope this was helpful. If you have any questions or 
you want any ideas or you are confused by what I do and when, um, I'd be happy to uh, break something out of the jar for you. So have a great day. Thanks for watching.